say um, that when the when the child um, is suffering abuse, they should um, that's when the state should intervene. And yet the state and the care system itself isn't questioned in, in its in itself. I mean, who says that the care system is actually good? And what rights do young people have when they enter the care system? Because I know personally from being in the care system, we're from NAPEG, which is the National Association of Young People in Care. And we, we've been in care, and we're now fighting for the rights of young people in care. But we're kept on such a low profile basis, because social workers don't want young people to know their rights. They don't, they don't want you know, young people to say, well, you can't let this happen to me, because this is my right. They, they don't want that at all. A social worker can do what they, what they want to you, and the young person doesn't have any rights. And so that's why young people end up sniffing and on drugs, prostitution, end up in assessment centres, secure units, locked up. Because, and, and that's the state. Helena Widdison, is care better than home? I think it depends really. Because um, when I was put into care at the age of five, I was put into care mainly because my mum was an alcoholic. And almost my foster parents that I went to eventually, I think they were worse. I think I, I suffered a lot of mental abuse there. I was told I wasn't loved. I was told how I should think, what I should think. Um, so I, I think I really hated care then. But when I voted with my feet, as the saying goes, and ran away, and found out what my mum was really like, which I wasn't allowed to, you know, know the social services said, oh, she's too young to know what her mum's really like. Um, when I left her, I put myself in voluntary care, and I thought it was great. And I, in fact, I still am in care now. I'm 20 years old, and they supported me through college. Um, so I think it has got... It's, it's, it's advantages. I think it does help you out if you just know how to use it. What about anybody else from, from the group there who likes to? Yeah. Yeah, but I mean, it, that, that's, that's good that this, the system can help you, but you have to know how to use it and you have to play it their way. Mm -hmm. The minute that you start to do anything wrong, then that's it. It's like, okay, well, well they're going to go out glue sniffing or on drugs. Let's just leave them. Let's put them into lodgings at 16 or 17. Let's keep the ones who are going to college, doing this, got a full-time job. Let's keep them in care till they're 18, give them accommodation, finance them through college or through whatever. But what happens to the young people that don't want to play that system or don't feel they can? So you were actually saying that society doesn't necessarily treat those that it takes into care any better than they were necessarily treated in their families first? 